Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Take a look at one of our four agreements. Love is responsible for its actions. Everything you think, everything you do has a consequence. And you will experience the consequences of your actions in one way or another. All human beings are completely responsible for their actions, even if they don't want to be. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 1137. You get the NASDAQ off uh, 542. We get the S&Ps off 159. Uh, that is a downdraft, folks, inside the NASDAQ of 4.5% inside the S&P's 4% uh, inside the Dow Industrials, 3.5%. Gold, gold contract flat at 18.19 an ounce. You get silver down 26 cents, $21.49 an ounce. Light sweet crude off $3.44 at 108.96. Notes and bonds, a 10 year note is up 17 ticks, trading 119.12. 30 year up a full point and a half at 140.07. And King Dollar just won't give it up, man. King Dollar is up 448 ticks. Trading at 103.808, euro is at 104, yen is at 128, and the British pound is at 123 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world and the world of the S&Ps? Let's take a look at them. Okay, so intraday out here, folks, this is what you have. We get a bad market, no doubt, but guess what? You have an, an, another ABC structure down intraday. So right now we're at 3923. You're going to see this. I'll set this up for you. You can see how this works. So you're going to, this ABC here, yeah, A point is the 3974. The B point is down there at the 3927. Your C point is up there at the 3942. You broke it with volume. That sets up, uh, where am I? I got so many different ABCs here, it's amazing. 3884, now we can get the 3884 today. That's how this is setting up. You got a weak market, you broke the B point, you broke it on volume. Okay, so that's the first part. Second part, let's get to where we think this may go. So what you have out here today is this. The SPY's down $16, you're at 392. Your B point on a potential ABC down is 385.15. If you're a bull, what you'd love to see is this hit the low today. Because right at this particular point, you get 71 million shares. Bottom line, that's not big volume. You're coming into 125 million. What I expect we're going to see is that you're not going to get down to this 385. What you're going to see is you, it's a down market. I expect this ABC structure on the way down could very well hit before four o'clock and then the market wakes up in the morning folks and just blows this number away that's in your spy we take a look at the ndx 100 the three q's same type of setup what you have with the nq's right now they're down 14 and a half dollars you're at 281 you get 58 million shares traded the highs of the lows is uh 295.75 you know You've listened to me many times. You know that when you get into a bar, the top of that bar is 295. The bottom is 284. We're four points into it. We're going to the bottom of the bar. I don't expect we'll get there today. If we did get there today, that, that'd be good. Bottom line, I don't expect it, though. I expect what you're going to see is that we're going to get lower because the Qs have, uh, where am I? The NQs. Let me pull the NQs up because they're on an ABC structure down to intraday. NQ. Okay, so the NQs, where did I put this one? Here we go, okay. So we're at 11,960. It did the same deal. Bottom line, you can see this bar at uh, 230. Check out the B point. That sets up 11,822. And right now, you're 11,951. So bottom line is that uh, Intraday, that's what we have. Now, if we go over to the Qs and we take a look at the Qs, what we have 
is that you're going to see that the B point of a potential ABC down is laying out here at that 284. You know, you're going to need volume of 120 million. Right now, I only got 60, so I don't expect we're going to get it out here today. You, what I do expect we're going to see is that you are going to get a, a surge of volume at the close. You know, and that see the the thing that's wild about this. So watch how volume works, folks. Is that and this is subtle, but I've been doing this for so long that I just want you to understand something here. So picture that we get a big bounce. Well, if we get a big bounce, you're going to have a volume, high volume low. If we don't get a bounce, you're going to have more people selling at the close. So this is kind of where this sits when you've been down all day. That's, that's how this baby is set up. Let's go to Earl in Seminole. Hey, Earl, what's going on? Hey, Tom, how you doing? Looks like a wild ride coming. It certainly is a wild ride. There's no doubt about that, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd like to have you take a look at uh, where you think Bitcoin might be headed. XBT. So do you trade Bitcoin? Do you own Bitcoin? What do you do? I'm shorter than an ETF. I say, okay. So right now, Bitcoin broke. You got, you're at 29,000 right now. I suspect, you, well, let me put this on a weekly. Okay, so 31,000. Yeah, I mean, this looks like this is going after its low again. I mean, the, the, the spike low we had last week was 29,000. Uh, no, 25,422. So my take is that it will get down there. You break that, and then 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 you're talking about real action. Then you're talking about like 18,900. You break that, and then you're back down to like 11,800. So it's serious business, man, on the way down. Yeah, that's what it looked like to me. I got one more question, uh, not off the stocks, but where do you see the real estate valuation going? Does it look like we're headed into a recession? Yes. Yes. There's no, there's, the, I mean, what happens is that, you know, you've heard me say this many times. What happens, folks, in the whole economy is that take a pencil and put it in your hand and then take a piece of paper and write your name. That's the structure that we're in. Whatever your signature is worth, and right now, because interest rates are going higher, all our signatures, I don't care how much money you get, are worth less money. So that means we're going down.